welcome back to our channel before we jump into today's demo just a quick reminder this is part of a series if you haven't seen the previous videos yet be sure to check them out for a deeper understanding of the tool now let's get started with today's tutorial first of all log into your task tracker account enter your credentials click on sign in first step would be to add team member so click on add team member enter all the basic information assign them a role here we do have three different types of roles and roles are given to define their permissions and rights first is manager manager can add team members and can add buckets and tasks he can also check all the tasks of the company so he have complete access people on the role of senior management directors can be managers in task tracker second is assistant manager who can assign tasks to others but can only see tasks that are assigned by him and tasks of his assigned team member he cannot see anything else then we have team member who just need to see his tasks and complete them and mark them close he cannot add a task to someone else he can add tasks to himself so choose the roles accordingly and then uh, fill the other details choose yes or no for attendance and time sheets because these features are optional click on the save button to add your team member Once added, your team member will receive all credentials on WhatsApp and he can now log into Task Tracker. Second step for us is to add bucket. Buckets are categories of your different tasks. So they can be your clients, projects, and departments. So create the bucket for each of your departments or clients or project. And now we are ready to add tasks. The third step, the main and most simple step. Click on add task or you can also click on the plus button at the bottom right of the screen. Select your bucket of this task. Let's assume the task is of project alpha. Then choose your team member who will have to do this task. I want Rahul to do this work. You can give this task to many people, including yourself, and if in case needed, you can tag someone else as well just to share the notifications with him. I'm assigning this task to three people and I'm tagging their unit head, Sunny, to get notified about this task. Then we can set a due date. While the time is optional. On the due date, the team member gets a morning WhatsApp reminder. And as for the due time, the team member gets a one hour prior reminder. If you set the priority of this task to high, team member will receive two additional reminders on email, a two day and a one day prior reminder on email. Then you can upload a file. If you need an attachment as a proof of work in return, you can make it mandatory by clicking on yes. And by recurring task, you can get this task repeated on any of the given duration. So critical tasks like credit card bills, regular checks, maintenance can be easily automated through it without any hassle and fear. Write the description of task. You can also draw voice note in tasks so that you can assign it easily and the team member can understand the same task easily. You can play it and then save the task. When a task is assigned, the team member will receive an instant notification on WhatsApp and he can check his dashboard to see all the tasks. You will find the list of the team members and you can click on their names to see what all work is assigned and how many tasks are pending. You can find the name of your team members and buckets on the main home screen. 
You can click on their names to see their dashboards and check how many tasks are assigned, close and open. Team members can go to my task dashboard and check all the tasks assigned. If any of the task is done, the team member can swipe it to right to close it. Task will get closed instantly. If the team member is facing any problem or want to give any update regarding a particular task, he can add remarks on it. And you will be getting up all these remarks on your WhatsApp. You being manager can make updates in details of task and you can also reopen a closed task as well. While closing the task, the location timing is captured and the team members can upload files in. When a team member opens his task tracker app first time in the day, he will see this pop up with his end time and end location on the screen automatically. For marking his attendance, he need to click on this punch in button to mark his attendance with a given location and in time. His attendance is marked. You can check the live attendance statuses in this attendance view. Different color codes represent different statuses of attendance. In attendance, let's talk about leaves. Employees can request leave by going to leave application and clicking on apply for leave. Select the date and reporting manager and leave type. Write the reason for leave and click on submit. Managers receive instant notifications and can approve or reject request by a single click. And eventually you can check the attendance reports to check how many leaves are taken by the team member. HR teams can generate reports on leave trends, track absenteeism and ensure smooth workforce planning. Then we can see charts of the team members. Here's a chart view where you can see all the details and current progress update of all the team members on a single screen along with their performance scores. If you want to check the tasks in more detail, you can click on show all tasks. Now item list. Item list is a lightweight to-do list inside task tracker. It helps you capture tasks instantly and decide whether to complete them or convert them into full-fledged tasks. How to use the item list? Click on add item, enter your task details and save it. Once an item is added, you have two options. Close it when it is completed or convert into a proper task if it requires detailed tracking and assignment. You can also switch your language to any other language. And by the help section, you can take help in using this tool. You can check web manual, you can ask a question and you can also check the demo videos. For punching out, you need to click on this watch icon. Punch out. Thanks for watching. I hope this tutorial helped you to master the tool. If you have a business or a company, comment down below and don't forget to check out our website to learn more. Have a nice day. Happy tracking.